Zach, where are we? I don't know. Zach, where are we? Uh... Dude, where are we, man? Route 66, uptown Catholic, the Coopin County Courthouse. Come on, man, you're, you're right there. It's on the tip of your tongue. Where are we? Did you say Uptown Tavern? I did. Are we in Yorkville? No, nope, no, nope. come on, come uh, on. Colder, colder. Uh, Collinsville. No. Closer, get the first letter right. And the kind of the end, but the middle part, still a little, little sketchy. Uptown Tavern. Joey Naples, stag on draft. Oh, 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 oh. Collinsville, Collinsville. Yes. Come on. You want something to drink besides steak? <laughs> I got one more regular dollar. What's up, friends? Welcome back. And today we are in historic Corlinville, Illinois. Great little downtown area right here. A beautiful stop along Route 66. And today we are visiting the Uptown Tavern. This bar was established in 1946. It's the oldest bar that in Carlinville, old. Illinois. It's very old. Uh, our good buddy Joey Naples took it over in 2017, established the Uptown Tavern. We've gotten a quick peek inside, incredible decor, great vibe, and Stag has been on tap at this bar since the beginning, so I'm looking forward to that. I'm a Stag guy. I'm Nick. And I'm Zach. And this is Raising a Glass with, with Nick, Nick and Zach. Zach. Let's go. Not good. I got a lot of opinions. Just about stuff. <laughs> oh man. What? How's it going guys? Joey, what's up man? Good to Welcome. see you. Good to see you. Welcome out of town. I feel like if we're at Uptown, we have to drink a stag. Is that right? Is that a rule? Frosty mug, baby. Frosty mug. Frosty mug since 1946. Let's do that. Let's do it. All right. Zach, what, what are we noticing immediately being here? Um, There's they, so much going on, which is great. I love Like it. all of your favorite classic beer merchandise and like advertising is here. Yeah. Like all the good stuff. And it's awesome. You got the big bubble Budweiser cans. Front of really cool, authentic, retro bar stuff. Oh, we're here. There you go. Awesome. Enjoy. Cheers. Dude, I love a frosted mug. I did too. I did too. <laughs> so what's, like what's special about the about the frosted mug? It's just like specific to no, the spot? I, I mean, obviously it's not a new thing, but like, why does it have to be in a frosted mug? I just think it makes the draft beer go down better. And uh, it's getting harder and harder to find a frosty mug. And, yeah, and how do you make a frosty mug? I'll leave it in the deep freeze overnight. That's it. That's, you it. Don't, That's it. You don't like wet it down or anything? No. No, no. okay. Yeah. Cool. Pretty simple. Keep it cold. I like it. Well, cheers, brother. Raise the glass. Woo. It's the name of the show. Oh, okay. It's 2017. 2017. How long did it take you to, you know, get all this decor in there to, to you know, make this space feel as great as it does now? Uh, well, honestly, uh, I've been collecting this stuff since I was about 14. Cool. Uh, I just like it. I like the Americana, the history, the, uh, Relay, it's relatable history is what I like to call it. So some of these signs have been hanging in here since the 80s. Um, this sign is original to the bar, 1990. Yes. But uh, it just makes it relatable and kind of touch back in time. All right, Joey, what do we got to get? What must have. Oh, Sandbell Shrimp can't go wrong. Sandbell Named shrimp. after a popular vacation destination. Yeah. It's like sweet and spicy, hand breaded shrimp over a slaw mix. Very good. Let's do. Do that. Okay. I definitely want the uh, the fish taco. The fish taco. Wait. What are what are Joey? What's the Joey style drink? So that's the best way to get them. Uh, and of course. Yeah. Of course. Uh, hey. Housemade. Yeah. <laughs> housemade. Housemade buffalo. Classic style. It's not too spicy. Yes. Uh, tossed. Set on the table. Uh, tossed with some uh, salt and pepper mix. A blend I've used since I was started cooking. So damn good. Very good. As I've said before, if a bar has a popcorn machine and you don't fill up a boat, you're a fool. There we go. And there's nothing like eating popcorn out of a boat. You know, you go to Ace Hardware, you get a bag. You go to, you go to the movies, you get a big old bowl. But a boat, 
a boat says dive bar. And I love exactly what it says. Try this somewhere else. I got it. Did it really? No. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Let's just all hit triple triple ponies. Oh, is that a ball? Is that a ball? And he's gone. Oh. Forty. They don't buy and they don't buy. Oh. Not great. Not great. I hate everything. Why am I hitting the I you hit the devils and the triples whenever you don't want the devils and the triples. That'll work. That'll work. We're safe. Freaking chicken, man. Here's a winner. You're looking at him. So what do you need here? Uh, is it a single? Twelve. It's one ball, right? One, 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 twelve. Trash. <laughs> this close. Let's go! First one of the series. Big dogs in the house, feeling strong. I told you, Mom. Taco. No way. Not only does Uptown oh. Tavern have awesome cold frosted beer, we're drinking stag today. This food is incredible. From the moment they brought it out, I've just been taking in the smells. It looks, it's, it's like the presentation is insane. A bar that also has incredible food. Like you, you can't go wrong. I, you just are exuding happiness right now. I can, I can, I can feel that. I really wish we could solve. You stop talking. You stop talking. Okay, G give us a bite of that. I'll take a bite of. I'm gonna, I'm gonna dive in on the shrimp here. Go up the way now. Yeah. Sure. Mm. Okay. Nice. It's short for That's right. Dude. And the sauce good. If you're coming to Uptown Tavern, get your wings Joey style. These are insane. Now, Zach, you're you're a big fish guy. I know that. I like. I mean, I like it all. Yeah, yeah. But burgers and fish tacos, especially. That's it for you. I want you forget the taco for a second. Just give me your reaction to the fish. Just the fish. Uh oh. Pepper. Yeah. That's a good batter. Yeah. One of the most notable mm -hmm. things when you come into Carlinville is to see the huge courthouse building. The Newton it's County. It's massive. When we, were driving in, when we were driving into town, we noticed a little bit of a skyline, and I'm like, yo, we're in rural yeah. Illinois, but we see the top of this courthouse. It's they, they call it the million dollar courthouse, right? So monster. Finished in 1870, it was worth one point, it was a 1.3 yeah. million dollar project, which if you think about it, in 1870, nowadays, who knows how much, you know, the, the comparison of cost there, it's insane. But very well known, you know, piece of architecture here in Carlinville, and it's cool, you know, that it's like overlooking the downtown area. It's time, once again, best segment in the entire world. How fast can I, Zach, lose five dollars? We're here at the Uptown Tavern, and we're gonna give it our best shot. So, let's go. What's the special? What do you got? Uh, one drink, one drink for four dollars. I need to get rid of five. Five. Uh, I got two baby beers for six. I need something for five. Five. Uh, two baby beers, five fifty. Brother, five bucks. All I've got is five. Two baby beers, five bucks. You clean up the popcorn you spilled it earlier. You got a deal. So done. <laughs> I love it, Happily, and I did feel bad about that. Sorry. And if you can make this quick, uh, we're. I mean, I'm trying not to get our worst one yet. Wait. So what's a baby beer? Baby beer, liquor forty three. 
Brazilian cordial liqueur. Tastes like vanilla and 43 other ingredients. Very good. Heavy Prairie Farms whipping cream. Prairie Farms only. In the glass mugs, because feeling special. That's oh. our house shot. Two for five. What a gentleman. Hey! Oh, I just saw you here, and I think, I think we should try this together. This is how fast can Zach lose five dollars. It's been a minute, 17 seconds, and this is Raising a Glass with Nick and Zach. Cheers. Mm. Oh, baby beers, it's so cute. Oh. Thanks, Joey, I love that. You're welcome, you're welcome. Thank you, guys. Ooh, like Brooms are in the back. That's really awesome. Yeah, you nailed it. No uh, good bar is complete without an awesome jukebox machine. This song actually gets to the heart of this series and the heart of this moment in time that we're experiencing right here. Sometimes I'm gonna have to Love you guys. Love you guys. The best. Good night, Carlinville. Good afternoon. I'll go back here.